In this video, I have x to the power of 5 minus y to the power of 5 equals to x minus y times x to the power of 4 plus x cubed y plus x squared y squared plus x y cubed plus y to the power of 4. So if I want to go from right to left, I just multiply it here, x by all these terms and then negative y by all these terms. So it's going to be x to the power of 5 plus x to the power of 4y plus x cubed y squared plus x squared y cubed plus x y to the power of 4. Then I have negative x to the power of 4y, negative x cubed y squared, negative x squared y cubed, negative x y to the power of 4, and negative y to the power of 5. This one and this one cancel out. 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 So it will be x to the power of 5 minus y to the power of 5. So that will be the answer. From left to right, when we have x to the power of 5 minus y to the power of 5 divided by x minus y. So I can say x to the power of 4. So it will be x to the power of 5 minus y x to the power of 4 is to cancel out negative y to the power of 5 plus y x to the power of 4. So I need to multiply it by x to the power of 3y. So it will be x to the power of 4y minus x cubed y squared. This to cancel out negative y to the power of 5 plus x cubed y squared. Then I multiply it by x squared y squared. So I will have x cubed y squared minus x squared y cubed. This to cancel out, negative y to the power of 5 plus x squared y cubed. Then for next one, I need to multiply it by x y cubed. So it will be x squared y cubed minus x y to the power of 4. This to cancel out, it will be negative y to the power of 5 plus x y to the power of 4. Then you will have y to the power of 4 times x will be x y to the power of 4 minus y to the power of 5. Then you subtract it, it will be 0. So the answer is when x to the power of 5 minus y to the power of 5 divided by x minus y. It will be x to the power of 4 plus x cubed y plus x squared y squared plus x y cubed plus y to the power of 4. That will be the final answer.